Welcome to Delam, and welcome to Playing Ketchup. Hi everyone, Hungry Reader here. I'm back. Uh, did you notice that I was gone? I kind of did. I kind of spent the whole summer not doing this, and I felt really bad about it, but, you know, there are a lot of reasons that I usually take the summer off. One of which, uh, I don't know if you've heard about this, but uh, summer is hot. It makes it really hard to concentrate on what you're doing, especially if you have to spend a lot of time sitting at a computer editing and instead of, you know, sitting in front of a fan, not dying. Anyway, now we are returning to Earthbound. And last we saw of our heroes in Earthbound, uh, they had just defeated Thunder and Storm, and two of them were dead. I took the liberty of bringing them back to life while you weren't looking. And... Now, whoop, hang on a second. <laughs> oh, so if you're wondering about the new face cam, uh, it's my phone. So sometimes little messages might pop up on it, like the one that just popped up saying, it's time to work on your Hungry Reader stuff. I've got one of those, don't you? Anyway, so now everyone's ready and willing. So let's go, let's use the sigh, the teleport. No? Teleport. Teleport, yes. And go back to Summers. There we go. Okay. Boop. Boy, I'm just not prepared at all today. Anyway. Let's hike on back to the port town of Toto. You can't, uh, you can't teleport directly to Toto for whatever reason. Oh, hey lady. I can no longer bake magic cakes. But it doesn't matter because I'm selling magic tarts, which tastes even better than magic cakes. Uh, I think I bought one of these before, but it's probably a good idea to have more. Yeah, I, there's, there's the one I bought before. But let's give one to Ness. Okay, now we're prepared, because it is so hard to get magic in this game. I mean, psychic power, sorry. A museum. <sighs> Long hike. Long hike through a beautiful resort town, so uh, not the worst thing that could happen. Uh, this is. Pictures taken, blah 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 yeah, I gotta stop the action every 10 seconds to take a photo, and you're not even gonna look at them because you're gonna be reading the credits. Anyway. What happened there? Something weird happened to that boat sprite, I think. Or maybe I was just imagining it. Well, we'll see when I uh, go back through. Hello, Toto. Thank you. You made my wife wake up. She quit talking about all that serious crap. <gasps> a Super Nintendo game that says crap. <gasps> he said the crap word. Yeah, let's work hard. Uh, I'm gonna guess that in the original Japanese that was GANBATE. If you're courageous, get on this boat. You'll probably see the Kraken and experience getting seasick. After all, it could only cost you your life and you got that for free. That's a kind of a good life lesson. <laughs> Or a terrible one. <laughs> so, do you want to sail the seas to Skaraba? Oh, okay. Oh, who's going to charge me? Good thing I've got a ton of money in my pocket. We're reckless, baby! Bon voyage! Oh, wait, you're not coming with? Oh, you are coming with. Okay. That boat does look a little different. And now for a long, non-interactive animation where we become more and more aware of the fact that the boat looks like it's looking at you, even smiling at you. Dun, dun. Oh, okay. Ooh, Final Fantasy mode. So here are all these islands that we don't get to explore. I wonder what they are. So it's like, wait, 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 wait! I need to stop the boat! 
It's been a long time since I was on the open sea, so I feel seasick. Oh man, what are we gonna do? A sailor who gets seasick? So how come you guys are all right? That bald guy over there, your buddy, right? He came from Dalam. You guys must be quite the adventure. Ah, <laughs> I'm feeling much better now. Anchors away! So we basically walked from uh, the south of France to Italy, and now we're journeying straight from Italy to North Africa. And there are all these plat patches of darker blue water, just like in real life. I guess. I've never sailed to Africa before. Ooh. A storm is coming. What? Here it comes! Confine the Kraken! Okay. Look at this thing. It's got... This is a monster that has teeth arranged like Akbar and Jeff's eyes. <laughs> it's it's the Peppa Pig of sea monsters. <laughs> anyway, let's fight it. Um, okay. Uh, oh, why don't I give you a big hard flash and give you a big freeze. Yes. And how about hungry HP sucker for you? And yes, a big freeze for you too. Is it vulnerable? Yes, it is. Yeah! Uh-oh. Oh, great. So now Paul and Pooh are both going to try and attack us. Oh, yeah. All right. Just keep mothering him up and... Hmm. Is there something I could use? What? No, not right candy. No. Pray! Let's see what happens. And... Oh, he's got big bottle rockets! Use that! Do you have anything that could attack with? No? Okay. Uh... Why don't you... Heal yourself! Alright! Well, not that we'd taken any danger. Oh, good. Alright! Oh! Well, that was not a difficult battle at all. I need to remember about those big bottle rockets. Do dee dee doo dee doo. Everyone's got a whole lot more HP and doo dee doo dee doo. Oh, also, uh, before I got set up here, I equipped uh, Pooh with that Bracer of Kings. You know what a bracer is? It's like a bracelet, but it goes all the way up the arm. Oh man, I thought you guys were just everyday little kids, but you defeated the Kraken! I also helped in the battle. I threw my slippers at the beast, maybe you didn't notice. Oh wow, this guy is uh, Marie from the Nutcracker. He threw his shoe and uh, defeated the Mouse King. This is the closest thing to a nest hat that I own, by the way. I, I might get another one for uh, future plays. Sail through the purple water to... Now I guess this is more like the Middle East than uh, Africa proper. Actually, we're on our way to darkest Africa right now. Pardon the pun. No problem here. How about you? Did you come from Toto by ship? There's a scary monster in the sea. Did you beat him? Or did you escape? Either way, you're fantastic! Yeah, we're great escapers. Uh, hello. I'm doing this as a hobby. Is it cool? I recently met a friend. He used to be a dungeon maker. I'll bet I know this guy. And now he's a dungeon man. <gasps> dungeon man! Would you like to meet him? Yes. Alrighty then. I'll give you the key so you can enter him. I don't want to enter your friend. Oh, no, I don't. Oh, thank God. We must have lost it somewhere. That's fine. I'm sorry. I don't worry about small things. I don't sweat the small stuff. And it's all small stuff. Uh, hi. 
Oh, be careful where you walk. It's filthy. Yeah, there's sand everywhere. A chubby kid did his business out here somewhere. Pokey stink still hangs in the air. Don't step in the poke rafts. Oh, Paul's got sunstroke. Who's surprised? Not Ness. All right. <laughs> Hassan's shop! I, I don't think I actually picked up on that pun until this very playthrough. Okay. Uh, hello, uh, turbaned uh, Mr. T. Yes, I'm Red Snake. Come on in. Kiss of fire. Armpit hair fertilizer. Yes. What is it you want to pal? Snake. Viper. <laughs> Vial of serum. So. So, if you. Hey, all you Pokemon fans, I'll bet you never knew that Ekans backward is just Snake. And Arbok backward is just Viper. Try it yourself. And Muir's Fulia Fulave is Vial of Serum backwards. Oh no, you disappoint me. Well, it's nice to meet you all. Hello, would you like some seasonings to add to your foods at mealtime? They're really quite miraculous. Oh yeah, we've done these before. Uh, how about salt packet? How about... Paula, she's got the rock candy. Okay. So, hi there. Oh, you have the mark of bad luck on your face. Uh, that's, that's just a zit. No, don't worry. If you want to know, I'll humbly tell you. You shall come back here after you have encountered a dangerous situation. However, I may be wrong, and if so, a thousand pardons. Uh, uh, back's starting to hurt. Anyway. I bought a piggy nose. This will help out a large amount while I am humbly searching for the magic truffle in the deep darkness. You too can learn how to use a piggy nose with the use command under goods. <laughs> so please rest easy. Oh, okay. Why would I want a snake sack? Why would I want a sack full of snakes? How useful is this? Maybe the enemies around here are really vulnerable to poison or strangulation or being overcuted by cute snakes oh I already talked to you okay how about you if you're ready to go what you need great <laughs> let's see you got Ooh, hey some actually good stuff okay let's have yeah crystal charm Give it to my sweetie. Yeah. Oh, her defense went up one point. Goody. That's a pretty good charm. I wouldn't call it a great charm. Yeah, let's get that. For the first time, a bat that's better than T-Rex's bat. Oh, he can't hold it. Uh, I don't know. What can I sell him? A snake! I don't want a snake. Alright. What'll it be? What'll it be? Yeah. Alright. This is always the best part is when you're like, Yeah, yeah, yeah! Power me up! Oh, a broken... Well, a broken anything is usually good for Jeff, so... And he's got... Yes, he does. Uh, let's see. No, because I need more money. Where I think there's an ATM in in the hotel. Yes. Oh, but that's not the hotel. Where am I? Oh, hello, old guy. I've never seen you around here. Where's my wife? What do you want? I don't have anything you'd want. I I guess he's new to being an RPG character, huh? Oh. Pardon me, I had a bottle of uh, Mountain Dew Pitch Black. Ah, ATM. ATM, ATM. Oh, I hate when I do that. 
Okay. I think I need at least this much. Okay. Now... Back to Mr. Mall. There he is. Ah! Oh, twice! You know, this happened while I was, uh, getting everyone healed, too, and I thought, well, at least it won't be part of the story. <sighs> blah, 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 blah! <sighs> and to think that my brother once went to a lot of trouble to get a photo of himself with uh, Dr. Demento. The real Dr. Demento. Okay. What do we got? Yes. Two platinum bands. Yes. Yeah. All right. One of me. One of me. Another platinum band. Yes. Yeah. I don't know. What can I get? A piggy nose. I'll bet I could use that piggy nose. Uh, Jeff can have it. Yes. Nope. Alright. Who are you? What do you want to buy? Oh. What? Some of these things are... Hmm. Oh, bottle of water. Oh, and they're... I think they're cheaper here than they were. <laughs> Should just keep loading poo up with water. It's like a softener. Molokhea soup. I don't know. Eh. Anyway. Let's go put my cash back in the bank. And head down into Scrub. Wait, no. Not a withdrawal. A negative withdrawal. Uh, <laughs> stop doing that. Okay. <laughs> I guess I can't do that. There we go. Could stand to have a few books on me while I'm out. Ooh, it's hot and sweaty already. Oh, it's like walking into Fresno. Oh, hello. I could probably use that. Uh, oh, hi, who are you? I sell water. Oh, oh, it's deluxe water. You know? Yeah. <laughs> Just keep getting poo water. More water! Alright. But if I go... Hey! One of you guys! I remember you from that last desert! Oh, the Great Crested Buka. I'll bet they're endangered. So let's beat the crap out of it. Hit! Punch! Smacko! Attacko! Ooh. This doesn't seem like the kind of thing I should waste uh, Psy on. It looked too cute. But this is where I want to be. Yes. Okay, nobody's got uh, Sunstroke. I think we're ready. Oh, and in case you forgot. To fight against the invaders, we built this pyramid fortress. <gasps> this is a fortress. However, our efforts were futile and we lost. Nonetheless, our pyramid was protected by the gods of Scaraba. The invaders will be reborn every millennium and will attack again. Even now, the invaders be hide beyond space and time and build their evil stronghold. A place out of time is beyond the dark. Uh, it is even further beyond the lost underworld. You're getting confusing. The deep darkness is shrouded. It is without light. Only one with the Hawkeye can pierce the dark. Oh, and if... Well, if Hawkeye won't... Do, if you don't have Hawkeye, you could always use radar. 
math joke. The Sphinx now watches over everything, waiting for the coming of a truly brave hero. That's me. Four, three, two, five. Dance in front of the Sphinx. You guys ready to dance? One. Are you a thief, a warrior, or one who has come to see my majesty? You must decide what you really are. Therefore, what will you do? One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Woo! Warriors, enter now. Search for the Hawkeye. Or the Colonel Kurtz. Three times in you know, the first time I played this game, it didn't seem like this was happening nearly as often. Of course, I spent a lot more time wandering around wondering what the heck to do. So. And now we literally are bound into the earth. Oh. Cockroach? Hi, cockroaches. Oh, no. Arachnid. Smackity smack, he smack, smack, stomp these guys. Yeah. He became tame. I'm just gonna have all these pet spiders following me around. It's gonna be adorable. Oh. Ooh, nice. Okay. That looks threatening. Like something is going to pop up and attack. Oh, yeah. I remember you, Shattered Men. Shadu B. Let's see, what can I use on him? I think, yeah, fire. I remember fire not working as well as I really expected it to. So. Let's use the freeze on him. Yep. It's really weird. Mummies that are weak to ice? Oh, wait. He's shattered. How did I not see that coming? Ooh, mummy wrap. Well, I'm from Egypt. Nothing runs with Egypt. And, oh, okay. Hello, hieroglyph. How adorable. <laughs> You know, it's a good thing that uh, the religions of Egypt aren't still alive, or this would be incredibly uh, sacrilegious. Whoa! Alright, Franklin Badge! <laughs> Never take it off. Never! Ooh. Oh, baby. <gasps> Healing. Oh. oh, I think... Wait. Yeah. Yes. Yes. This is the first thing that lets me bring my party members back to life without having to go to the doctor. Oh, yes. Ta-da! A dead dude. A viper. I just, just picked it up. So, did you at least use a gripper stick? Oh, speaking of vipers. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come over here. Oh, he wants to fight us. Oh, the lethal asp. Well, I am going to kick this asp. Poison? No poison. Whoa, nice. Yeah. Mom, I beat up a drawing of a snake. Good boy. Okay. <laughs> and the hieroglyph was like, Man, why didn't I go after them? God, I'm such a coward. I wanted to. Okay. Do you, would you like to ask me a question? Yeah. Just keep on smacking them. Here we go. 
Lethal is a pretty strong word. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Yeah, she could use a hamburger or something if I have one. I don't think I do, though. I don't have any food. Oh, I've got the rice gruel, yeah. Poo. Oh, oop, there goes the jar of deli sauce. Oh, well. It was free. <laughs> Hello! Hello, Mr. Jackalhead, how are you today? What? I caught a cold from a hieroglyph? Why did they equip the hieroglyph with the ability to give you a cold? That's nonsense! That's, that's madness! It's also cheap to fix. Okay. I'll bet this empty casket just standing right here is a monster. Oh. Yep, it's a petrified royal guard. <laughs> and I caught him in mid-stride. Boom, 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 boom. It's like he's on his way. He's like, gotta go! Okay. Why don't I give him a mother? And uh, a freeze. And... Huh. No, I'll save the big revolver right for uh, someone else. And a hungry HP sucker. And... Another freeze. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Stay frozen. Stay frosty. Yeah! He stopped moving. You know, if it were made of stone, I would think, am I just, is it just playing dead? This casket seems a little suspicious. Like zoinks! What do I do with it? Huh. So there isn't anything in particular I'm supposed to do with it? Good. Do I... Huh. Do I have something that I was supposed to use for this? It's not the piggy nose. <laughs> Bottle of water bring for lunch. No. No. Hmm. Sudden guts pill. I better use those. <laughs> Uh, I'm out of ideas. Oh well. We'll take a quick break in here. And we'll see you next time. And we'll finish off the pyramid. And maybe do a little light shopping in Delam while we're here. Delam, Scaraba. I'm sorry, we just got so lost in suburbia that I forgot what country we're in. Hope you're hungry.